Bowman here from BW1.com. I'm going to give you a quick walkthrough on how to upgrade the RAM and hard drive on the XPS M1530. So the first thing I'm going to show you here is what I'm exactly putting into it. This here is one gig sticks each. I'm going to put two gigs of memory inside of it. These are G-Skill memory that you can find off of Newegg.com for about 20 bucks. So it's pretty cheap to upgrade for two gigs of memory. And here is a 7200 RPM hard drive. This is the Seagate Momentus 7200.2, 160 gigabyte serial ATA hard drive. This only this laptop only takes serial ATA hard drives or SATA hard drives for sure. So you want to make sure if you're upgrading, you're gonna get yourself a SATA laptop, a SATA laptop hard drive. Also 2.5 inches, 2.5 inches. This is the fastest rated hard drive that I saw on Tom's Hardware, so I decided to pick it up. It's about $145 on zipsandfly.com. So the first thing here, we're going to upgrade the memory. So as you can see here at the top, this top section right here is sort of where you have to upgrade the memory. The memory is located right here. There will be five screws that you have to unscrew to lift this panel up, which I've already pre-done. To lift the panel up, you reveal the processor right here and also the memory. And to un uninstall the current memory, you just need to pull the two little side pins on the side just very gently and it will pop right up. Now to install the new memory all you have to do is slide through the memory in and make sure it lines up evenly with the bottom. And you press gently down and it'll snap right in. And you do the same with the top stick. So now all you have to do is close up the top panel here. and screw it down. Forty screws are embedded into the plate so they won't come out. The center one is the one that will actually come out that you'll need to, to take out. And that's upgrading the, the memory in the unit, the RAM. Now to upgrade your hard drive, the hard drive is located right here. But to do that, you're going to need to unscrew these four screws here at the top so it'll slide out on the side. So which I've already pre-taken out the screws here. You unscrew each one of these here at the top. There's four of them that will that'll go outside of the notebook. And the laptop will slide right out here on the side. Now what you'll need to do also is unscrew these two little two, two little screws right here to get this plastic piece here because you're going to need that to install the new hard drive. Just unscrew the side here. There we go. Got a big hand so it's a little bit harder for me to make sure these line up perfectly. Just slide it right back in and you fill it snap right in there and then you just screw the four screws here at the top And that's pretty much it. The only thing you'll need to do is turn it over here on the side and power on the unit. Once you power it on, the BIOS will kind of alert you to boot a little bit slower than the BIOS will kind of alert you that the hardware configurations have changed. You want to select up one to make sure that it does recognize the memory, does recognize the hard drive. And once you've done that, you're going to want to run your recovery CDs or your Windows disk to install Windows on the unit. This has been a quick walkthrough on how to install your RAM and your hard drive from on the M XPS M1530 from Bowman at BW1.com.